Welcome to your oracle face, very short oracle reading. Let's see what's in store for you this week. Okay. Spirit, what messages, what guidance can we have for Pisces? So, uh, transitions moving uh, going into better leaving things behind uh, and this is a lot of what you're planning to do what you're thinking of doing yeah what other messages do we have for Pisces spirit spirit I feel that a lot of you ah <sighs> It's like you're, you're being challenged to wherever you're right now and you don't want to play along. You don't want to play along at all. Yeah. So as I was saying that, sorry for the glitch, the camera is a little faulty right now today. Uh, as I was saying, so there's a lot of conflict going on because recently you found out that you've been betrayed about something and you don't want to be a part of that situation anymore and no matter what nothing is really actually consoling you nothing is helping you get to see past what happened and no amount of Consolation even from the universe is working but I'm getting a good card for you I I just pulled the six of wands for you because that was the card that was gonna flip and I feel that we're gonna get clarifiers and we're gonna see what's what's up ha huh, okay so you are in need of rest you got four of swords at the back of the deck energy you do need to cut yourself off from the source of this betrayal this sudden like this deception of course nobody anticipates deception but if you truly trust somebody but don't worry because the next phase of what's gonna happen is good because it's very obvious, it's very natural for you to not believe in anything new or be dissatisfied emotionally and not be in the correct space. But Spirit is saying that you're going to get recognition for what you've done. You're going to get recognition, not just that, you're going to be victorious. So whoever tried to deceive you, whoever betrayed you, whatever their aim was, that's clearly did, that did not work. Because yeah you are going to come out victorious anyway and right now you might feel that uh like my you might be going you know getting into that lazy negative part of the pisces and you can be like oh, i don't feel good but there's something that is must that um, that is spirit is telling me that quick action is going to come like you would not even know from where an opportunity comes and you get the you get this uh, opportunity to just go go in some other way go get away from the situation so let us pull more oracle uh, cards for you and see what's happening uh, spirit can you please help us uh, <laughs> Can you please help us uh, to figure it out for Pisces? Family changes. Wow, that's like a that's like a theme going on for you. Water elements, family changes. 
So this deception, this betrayal actually happened from your family. Okay, uh, Spirit King, we have more... Oh, my Pisces. My dear Pisces. Grief work. I'm actually... I suddenly feel that heaviness, you know, within me. I feel it. You're just... I'm actually going to read this one from the book for you. Because <laughs> I actually feel like my throat chakra is choking up because it's just such a heavy energy and you just never e expected that something like this is going to happen. And I'm wearing blue and green, but it's supposed to keep my chakras in help my chakras you know go on but like I feel that you're lost right now but that's we're just gonna find we're just going to see how she's written this okay this card signals that your heart needs some healing from one or more losses there's grief work to be done as a way of moving forward with your life Already you can think of how this specifically applies to you. Unhealed grief is compounded by each subsequent loss. That's medicine right there for you. Although it's uncomfortable to mourn and cry, sometimes this is the only path to heal. That's why it's best to heal with an experienced grief counsellor, grief support system or a trauma trained therapist. Loss is one of the more painful processes of change, yet it can also help us develop compassion and more appreciation for life. Your additional messages are changes that feel like a loss, a calling to be a grief counsellor. Maybe you guys have lost someone. Comforting a grief-stricken friend. Ah, this is powerful. I'm gonna continue see, continue and uh, understand why the Six of Wands came. Spirit, can you help? Healing from the past. Once you heal from the past, you will be victorious because you would have known what you're worth. <gasps> Windfall. <sighs> oh my God, this card is amazing. Wind. That's what I was saying. That suddenly things are gonna start looking up for you suddenly things are going to get better and because there's a really powerful message with this windfall and i'm gonna see a positive change in your finances is indicated by this card although the newfound abundance may be unexpected it definitely serves a purpose in your life your prayers for support have been heard and answered and now it is your role to utilize the windfall in the most beneficial way I know whatever you're going through is very hard but it's going to be all right this is a lesson you chose to learn your soul chose to learn nothing is without a cause so don't you worry my dear Pisces don't you worry okay pray and meditate to have the strength to say no to distancing distracting influences that could squander your resources you have access to divine wisdom to guide your investments so that they continue to support your health happiness and mission most of all do not allow any fluctuation in your finances to stress you as you have the power to be at peace with you uh, no matter what, what's going on around you as you emanate peace so too do you attract all that you need my dear dreamy pisces you are not of this world we all know that you are not of this world you are into fantasies and dreaming and i understand that because even though i don't embody pisces i am a water heavy um, my natal jar is full of water and i understand what you what you go through and I feel this, this is also happening in the collective. But don't you worry. Things will fall in place for you. Learn the lesson. This is something I keep telling. Learn the lesson from every grief that comes to comes to you. For everything that comes to you, learn that. Don't, don't worry about it. 
and I keep saying don't worry about it and I know how hard it is but spirit is really supporting you spirit is really supporting you and you know how I know that make a wish this is a magical moment to make a wish and enjoy its manifestation spirit is actually with you spirit divinely orchestrated all of this so you see what's for real you know what's for real and one of the ways you can help yourself is via morning affirmations uh, you know what just go ahead and type in uh, repro reprogramming your subconscious and you can go through just plug it in and go to sleep and it's all it's just going to work on your subconscious and things are gonna be fine guys yeah uh closing messages for my dear pisces closing message spirit is just like i'm gonna make everything fall for you oh, okay all right spirit spirit you remember that windfall abundance explore your options it's time to look at other possibilities. It's time to make, it's a good time to make changes. Empowerment. You are more powerful than you realize. It's safe for you to be powerful. Okay? It is safe for you to be powerful, my dear, dear Pisces. So, if you liked the reading, if you resonated with it, please hit the thumbs up button, subscribe, share, and hit the bell icon for sure. See you next week.